In order for title ownership of real estate to pass from one person to another, there must be delivery and acceptance of a written deed. The grantor simply writing and signing a deed is not enough. The grantor has to give it to the grantee, and the grantee has to accept the document. Delivery can be done through any means, as long as the signed original deed gets into the hands of the grantee. It can be mailed, delivered by hand, or delivered through an intermediary. Typically, in a real estate closing, the buyer and seller of the property will be present. The seller or grantor will sign the deed, but hand it back to the closing attorney. The closing attorney then has the deed recorded in the county real estate records. After the deed has been stamped and recorded by the county clerk, it is returned to the closing attorney, who sends it to the grantee. The grantee can designate an agent to receive the deed on his behalf. This is typically done with corporations and other entities. At that point, the transaction is legally complete, and title to the real estate has been passed to the grantee. Acceptance is not merely taking hold of the deed. There has to be a meeting of the minds. The grantee has to know what he is accepting, what the deed says, and agree to its terms. This includes an understanding regarding what specific property is being transferred. Also, what warranties and covenants are being made by the grantor, and what rights are being transferred to the grantee. If there is no meeting of the minds, and if the grantee does not accept the terms of the deed delivered, then the transaction may be voided and have no legal significance.